a promising technology for removing atmospheric CO2 is called geological carbon storage, and in this technology we take CO2 captured from coal-fired power plants and inject it into the subsurface as a storage option. And so the goal of our project has been to find ways to engineer these systems so that we can store the CO2 more effectively and more safely for longer time periods. So this is pure magnesium carbonate that formed uh, naturally in the subsurface. So all of these rocks came from a magnesium carbonate mine called Red Mountain, which is located about 70 miles from here, and it, it is one of the largest examples of a natural deposit of magnesium carbonate and it was mined economically for about 50 years. And so one idea would be to inject the CO2 into these different rock formations and try to convert it into a carbonate instead of store it as a fluid. And in this way we would permanently lock up the CO2 as a stable mineral in the subsurface. And so we've been looking at the structures and the veining to try and understand how the rocks were transformed into magnesium carbonate.